Hey everyone, in this video I'll be going over the split mask tool, which is new to Mimix version 19. And so the split mask tool is useful in when you want to separate two structures that are connected. Uh, beforehand, you, would, you used to have to go back and break these connections manually and then do like a region grow. Uh, but now with the split mask tool, we can quickly and easily separate connected structures without having to go through all of that manual effort. So I'm going to go to the segment menu and open up the split mask tool. And so this tool works uh, by marking the region that you want to split off in region A and everything else in region B. Uh, so let's say we want to split off the sacrum from the rest of the pelvis. I'll just mark that in region A. And you don't have to be exact or get every single portion of it. And then I'll mark the pelvis and the femurs in region B. And now, typically, you, you only have to do maybe a couple slices depending on your images and what you're trying to split off. Uh, but it basically uses your, your markings as well as the image intensity gradients to try to find the boundary between the two structures and separate them. And you can see a preview of your markings here in the 3D window. Uh, it also usually helps if if you're going to mark the areas where maybe they're connected or really close to each other, the tool will have a much better outcome, typically. So I'm going to hit OK. And you can see it has split off the sacrum for us. So we have two new masks now, this blue one with the sacrum, and then the red one for region B uh, that contains the pelvis and the femurs. So I encourage you to give this tool a try. It's really useful for a lot of different things. I've used it for, you know, separating out an aorta or pulmonary artery from the rest of a heart, a mandible from a maxilla, you know, femurs from the pelvis. Uh, it's really become one of my go-to tools for a lot of different situations.